In this session, you are going to solve one problem on lambda transition elimination from a transition system. Okay, now let us come to the problem. So now remove all lambda transitions from the following transition system. The transition system is given to us. We are having Q1, Q2, Q3. We are having transitions with input 1, input 2 and input 3 and we are having two lambda transitions. In our earlier video, we have discussed that what are the rules for eliminating lambda transitions from a transition system. So if you can summarize, then we are having mainly three rules. Rule number one is that, so let us suppose we are having this initial state, this is my lambda transition and that is another state. So after eliminating lambda transition, we shall go for this initial state to remain as initial state and this state will be made as the initial state. So that is our rule number, uh, I think it is rule number three okay, in our previous case, but we can also make it rule number one, so no issues. So they need not to be applied in a certain order. Okay. Another rule was that if there is a lambda transition and if this is the final state, then make the other one final state. So that was my another rule. So state 1, state 2, state 1, state 2. So I am just marking it so that we can get that which state is becoming final ultimately. So another rule was there that means that means whatever the outward edges are coming out from this state 2, please mark that edge and also consider that label and also draw the same edge from this particular one to that particular next state with the same label. So that was my another rule. So in my, in my previous video they, they were discussed. Okay. So please watch that one, I have done the summary here. So now let me apply the, this concept, these rules in my given problem. So how to solve it? Okay, so let, let me solve it at first. So I am just writing this. So I have eliminated all the lambda transitions, I have eliminated. Now let me apply, uh, say first one, first. If it is initial, as that is the lambda transition eliminated, so I should make this one initial. As it is become, it has become initial and here the lambda transition has got eliminated, so it should be initial. So first rule I have applied. So in this way I have got all the states as initial states. Now, now go for this one. As it is final state, lambda transition has got eliminated, so it should be final state. As it has become final state and lambda transition got eliminated, so it should be the final state. So in this way, I have seen that all the states have become final states. So this particular point we have discussed. Coming to the last, any outward edge from 2 to 3 will be also be, will be drawn from 1 to 3 with the same level. Now see, lambda transition is there and that is one edge is this one. So I must be having another edge like this. Lambda transition was there one edge was like this one. So I should draw another edge like this. So now see it is having one outward edge. So I am drawing the same edge with the same level to the same next state. Here the next state was Q3. So next state has become Q3. Here the self loop is there with the level 2. Next state was Q2. So from Q1 to, to Q2 I will be having the same input and same next state. But Another edge has been ha, have been drawn, na? another edge. So that is from Q2 to Q3 with the level 3. So that's why I should also draw another edge from this to this with the level 3. And that is the completion of my explanation. So in this way, the lambda transition can be eliminated applying these rules. And these rules can be applied in any order. But ultimately, you should reach in this in the, your final solution. I think you are getting the logic how the things are taking shape. Okay. Thanks for watching this video.